In this demonstration, we're going to use a new mesh method introduced in ANSYS version 13. The mesh method is called Cut Cell Cartesian. It's a good way to generate a large number of hexahedral elements on complex geometry. So we're going to use some of the um, automatic settings to start with. We're going to set the CFD um, meshing type. We're going to use curvature and proximity based meshing to capture um, any fillets or curved objects in the model, as well as um, proximity, so the number of cells between uh, gaps, so to ensure that you get good quality um, mesh and adequate resolution in these uh, small areas. And um, we're also going to use the uh, feature angle of 40 degrees, so this will ignore lots of uh, small patches and small surfaces within the model. These are the settings that are required and then we can generate a mesh in a highly automated manner. So here you can see the resulted mesh. It's predominantly hexahedral uh, in the far field, hexahedral also up to the boundaries with some uh, prisms, pyramids and tetrahedrals local to the surface to capture any of the sharp features. If we look at the mesh on the inside, you can see the mesh on the passengers and the seats. So you can see how it captures um, curved areas such as the heads of the passengers. And if we take a cut plane, um, we can then visualize the hexahedral volume mesh. And you can see how the mesh transitions from um, fine mesh near the surface to larger mesh with these series of buffer layers. So this is a highly um, automatic method with very minimal user input to generate a large number of hexahedral cells um, ideal for uh, CFD simulations.